But now the Democrats are pushing the most far left agenda ever put forward by a presidential nominee. Indian American voters are being courted by both the Republicans and Democrats this election cycle. The community has historically leaned Democrat, but has US President Donald Trump helped make inroads for the GOP? Florida businessman Digvija Danny Gaikwad had launched an ad campaign on 30 Indian channels, targeting the community which has emerged as a key constituency in the 2020 presidential election. Taking a cue from Indian Prime Minister Narin Modi's campaign slogan, Modi hai to mumkin hai, that Trump hai to safe hai campaign highlights the US President's support for India and his commitment to maintain law and order recovery, among other topics. Prime Minister Modi on issues of Kashmir and CAA. This is the president who never meddled in Indian affair, who give respect for their internal security, who understand their dignity, who gives them an honor. That is a friend of India. We don't want a president of America who comes and a medal in our work. The viral video featuring President Trump and Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi walking hand in hand and lathering praise on each other at a massive event held in Houston last year has already attracted more than a million views on social media platforms. And nearly 2,000 Indian Americans on his chat groups were sharing it at a furious pace. Danny Gaikwad, a top hotelier and real estate developer with strong ties to the Florida Republican establishment, says the excitement was unprecedented. Trump is a godsend opportunity for Indo-Americans if they want to have a say in this country, says Gayakwar, who believes this kind of outreach will make a difference in the outcome of the 3rd November elections. The Ek Bar Or Trump Sarkar ad has Gayakwar telling voters why Trump, very easy, he is a friend of India, he has proved himself he is a friend of India. There is no precise data on the number of Indian American voters. But based on estimates from various political groups, it lies somewhere between 1.6 to 2 million. A large number resides in states where the election results are a given. But they do have a significant presence in places like Michigan and Pennsylvania, where the races were tight and decided with a narrow margin in 2016. A first-generation Indian-American businessman, Gaikwad is the founder and CEO of NDS USA Information Technology an IT firm and Danny G management that runs a chain of restaurants and hotels across Florida. We are no longer just the ATMs, our votes will count, says Danny Kayakwar, who has a personal goal of boosting the Republican Indian American vote by an at least 10% in Florida. That is another battleground state in US presidential election. Subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button. Click the bell button and enjoy the latest uploads from our channel.